So in this video, I'll be showing you a wide receiver speed and strength workout. So I'm going to show you just the plan overall and how many workouts there is right now. And then we're going to go into some stretches. Here are some stretches you can do. So you can do this one inside or outside. So the first one, you just reach in the middle to get the legs stretched out right there. So do that for about 10 seconds or so. And then you can either do butterfly, which is probably one of my favorite ones. You just, yeah, like a butterfly. So then hold this for like 10 seconds. Try going as far as you can. Then I used to just do one for about 10, another 10 seconds, and then for the other ones, and you can come up with your own. But then I usually do like a arm swings, and then like this one, I don't know what it actually is. But like all of these basically for 10 seconds. And then this one, go back and forth for 10 seconds. Now, Let's actually get into the workouts. So for this workout, you need about four cones of any size really, and then a pass and catch football, or you can use a tennis ball if you want to. And then I usually wear my cleats, but you don't really need to. So let's get into the first workout. So for this one, it's hill sprints, and you're gonna do five to 10 of these. So let's start doing it. So for this one, you need the four cones. So you just need one cone for now. You can put it right about here or anywhere. And then take like three pretty big steps. Like four, like that. So, so far, I'll work with that. And then you just keep on doing three steps this way. So let's see right about right there. And then you will put the last one right up there. So let's do that. And this is the, as I call it, like the field goal, like speed, one foot, and off. And like this one named the field goal because it's like half of a field goal, and then you can just add another half. Like I'll put one right there and one right there. But for right now, I'm just gonna show you like this. And you're gonna do like five, five to ten, five to ten of these on each foot. So like, I'll have it right. Sorry about that. But then I have like one foot like that, go like that, cut, and then yeah. So let me just show you what that's gonna look like in fast motion. So I'm not sure how many I did, but like, I'll count. So if we do one. So I count as like half of one foot, so like five to ten on each foot. It's pretty tiring. You try to go as fast as possible. So like in total, you should have like twenty of those because like ten on this one, ten on this one. For this one, it's also cone. So I'm gonna actually show you two, but I'm not gonna do it. You're just lying, so four cones, one yard apart. So that's one of the cones. 
Now let me show you that. You're just gonna go like this. to the next workout. This workout is pull-ups. So like we're gonna be doing like 10 to 15 of these. So then you just yeah pull-ups. Make sure you guys know what pull-ups are. They are ten. So let's do time lapse of that. So this one we're gonna be doing Heisman jumps and you can do 20 to 25 of these. So Heisman jump you can have one foot up like this jump as far as possible or something like that and you go back and forth just like that so like one two three so i'm going to tell you in a time lapse 25 of those so let's get on to the next workout so the next one this is going to be working on your arms so it's called a v push-up so basically just go into a push up regular, just like this. And then you're gonna just move to make like a point. So try to have your hands behind like behind like your shoulders or something. And then you're just gonna go down to the ground like that. And then back up. Like that. So I'm not gonna time lapse this one. But yeah, do ten to like fifteen of those. So this one you need your pass and catch football or tennis ball. So you're just going to stand in the same spot, throw it against the wall, and catch it at different spots. And you're going to throw it against like 50 times. So let's do a time lapse. So I just did 50 of those. And yeah, just it's supposed to work on coordination. And like arm strength when thrown. So let's go on to box jumps. This one is going to be box jumps and you're going to do 10 to 15 of these. So you guys should know what box jumps are. I'm going to be jumping up here and yeah, box jumps like this. And you don't need to go fast up and down. Take your time. You just want to get that explosion. So let me show you what this can look like in ta time lapse. I just did near to 10 of them, but I usually do 15 just to get that explosion. So let's go on to the last one, but surely not the least. So the last one are just sit-ups. So you guys should know how to do sit-ups. But just, I usually do like 40 to 45 of these. But if you can't get that much, just go until your abs start hurting and your neck starts hurting. And you can almost not do it anymore. So please hit the subscribe button and please like this video, watch my other shorts, and go Jesus.